So now with the variable pitch prop option becoming available maybe even for LSA, as you can see we're moving the propeller blades here. Viking has a very simple system now, just a linear actuator and a mechanism to drive a shaft through the gearbox. We'd like to keep things simple and separated so you can work on things without having to send the whole propeller hub back to the manufacturer. That's why it's an external and simple mechanism. Here you can see the carrier moving inside the propeller blade. This is a typical three-bladed Duke propeller. You can see the shaft moving in and out and that's what's being actuated by this uh, linear actuator and the mechanism. Now if we take a look behind the or up front in the uh, propeller there will be a shaft. It's just kind of just laying in there right now but this will, shaft will be part of the propeller and it will just go clear through the gearbox, the Viking gearbox being centered rather than laying like we see it here. Use just a regular toggle switch and move your actuator back and forth just a tiny bit at a time to change the blade pitch. We're just playing around with a one amp breaker here. There will be a minimum breaker size in the airplane so that you can't break any parts. Here you can see the rod coming through the back. Here we're moving the carrier inside the propeller with our fingers to demonstrate how that actually works when you push and pull in the center there, there will be a bearing in there that supports that shaft that we looked at so that it stays stationary. You can also use, you know, a digital controller and make a constant speed.